What a lot of people don't realize is that power, the higher the voltage, exponentially the less resistance physically in the lines. So these high voltage lines that you see that go all across the place, 115,000 volts, they're used to move the power over a great distance. And when they get to a substation, and it comes to this transformer, and what this transformer does is it drops the voltage from what we call a transmission voltage moving over great distances to a lower distribution voltage. And then here, where these breakers are, it gets distributed out locally at a lower voltage that you're able to have those little transformers like this that are on pole tops that can drop the voltage down to 240 volts and bring it into folks houses and deliver the power and that's why these substations are here to bring the power from a transmission voltage down to a distribution voltage using these transformers and this particular transformer is able to take about 60 million watts worth of power off of the lines and deliver it locally and that's kind of the overview of what a lot of substations are and what they do there's different ones that do different things but this is your basic substation and why it's here and what it does